This is The Lockpicking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is a really interesting component from a Kirk Trapped Key Interlock System. As you can see, this panel has six key locations, and it's built like an absolute tank. This weighs in at over nine pounds. But before we get too deeply into the device, I want to explain what a key interlock system is. Every system is different, so it's a bit hard to generalize, but it's usually a safety system that makes it impossible to perform a potentially dangerous act without following a particular procedure. So if you look at this device, it's set up so I can either remove the key on the left, in which case the five keys on the right are trapped in place and can't be removed, or I can insert the key on the left, turn it halfway, and then any combination of keys on the right can be removed, but the key on the left cannot be removed until we reinsert all the keys on the right. Now we can imagine a scenario in which this might be useful. Let's say that these five keys open electrical panels and the breaker that feeds the panels has another interlock arranged such that this key can only be removed if the breaker is off. With that set up, the sub panels can only be accessed if there's no power in them. So it's not as much a security device as a safety device. That said, let's say some Darwin Award candidate really wants to electrocute themselves. Let's see what it would take to access the sub panels. We're going to pick this lock, which will allow us access to all of those keys. I'm going to use top of the keyway tension with this wiper insert and a standard hook in 25 thousandths. Nothing on one, two, three, four, five is binding. Nice click there. Click out of six, back to the beginning. Little movement on one. Little movement on two, nothing on three, four, five, and six. Little more movement on one. Click on two, nothing on three, four, five, or six. More movement on one. I'm guessing we have tapered driver pins because we keep setting the same pins over and over again. Another click out of six. One, two, click out of three, four, five, six. One is binding. It seems to be set really high. There we go, click out of one. Click out of two. We got this open. Let's rotate it fully. Now we can remove all the other keys. Okay, folks, I have always been fascinated by key interlock systems because of the unique and creative use of locks. That said, they should not be mistaken for security devices, even if they probably do provide better security than many locks sold today. In any case, that's all I have for you today. If you do have any questions or comments about this, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.